this is Craig from WTheMeExamples.com and today we're going to be vertically aligning our content within a column. So here we have a test page <clears throat> with a three columns, an image module here, text module, button module, and another text module. So we're going to add a background color to each of the columns. So we can see what happens when we vertically align. So we need to go all columns, this page, extend. So <clears throat> here we have our three columns. So what we're going to need to do is go into sizing and equalize column heights. So again, you can see the columns are equal heights and we have the background set to this darker gray in each of the columns. So if we wanted to vertically align this content in the middle, we would need to go into our content setting and this is the first column, second, third column. So in the second column, advanced tab, custom CSS, and we need to put margin auto and there you can see it's adding margin at the top and bottom of the same amount so the content sits in the middle and you can use this on whichever uh, column you want. So if you want to do the image, we can put margin auto in here too. You can see the image is now centered. But you lose the um, the background, the, the height of the column. So if you wanted to keep the background, Let's go into the second column and instead of margin auto, you're going to use display flex and then flex direction column justify content center. So now the content within the column is still centered and we keep the background image. So depending how you want the the design to look you can use either one of those so again if you want to do it in the second column you can do it here and again we have the the background has been kept so if you wanted to equalize all columns You can go back into your row settings and then under advanced, custom CSS and align items center. So then this does all three columns and, but again, it, um, it takes off the height of the column. So you don't have the background color equal so you might want to do it the other method if you need the background need to be using the background but then this can can work if that's the look you're going for and that's all you need to do to vertically align your content in Divi